Hello everyone, Dark Hovica here, and uh, we're going to be talking about the book club idea and announcing the book that I decided to go with for this month. Um, so this video is going up January 25th, 2022, which is a Tuesday, um, and every Tuesday I will be uploading a video basically with a collection of my thoughts for all of the chapters or one chapter, just all of the pages that I've read up until that point. It's going to be uh, category, or it's going to be by chapters in the video so I will mark up the video so that you can see when I'm hitting the next chapter so that if I'm ahead of you or behind you whatever you are able to see where I'm at and you can avoid spoilers um, just for the sake of this video if you see me move really odd or you happen to see like if I move the camera uh, my baby is currently sleeping on my lap he'll be fine he can sleep through the apocalypse um, but just in case in the middle of this video if he wakes up you see a baby arm fly up <laughs> Um, he's just asleep right now. So, uh, yeah, so let's talk about the book that I've decided to go with, which is Stephen Lawhead's Hood. It is a, it is a very thick book, <laughs> which I was like, I'm going to pick a, a, a thinner book for our first book. And then I went ahead and picked Hood. Not only that, but it is a trilogy. The second book is called Scarlet and the third book is called H uh, Tuck, excuse me. And, uh, I, I've just been dying to read this for a really long time. The first time that I got this book, I actually misplaced it and um, I was in a park and I left it behind and it's really funny because I had my paycheck as a bookmark in the book and I thought for sure oh, I better just cancel the check. Uh, well, a person called me to give me back my paycheck and mysteriously said there was no book with a paycheck. So I like to think that they genuinely found a book with a paycheck and was like, I want to keep the book. <laughs> because it looked so good. So there you go. Um, so yeah, Robin Hood, the legend begins anew. Uh, I'll read the back to you. So, oh, first of all, this is set in Wales. Um, there is a pronunciation guide at the back of this book, which is really great, but uh, I haven't had a chance to go through it and I'm going to be figuring this out as I go. I am so sorry in advance for more than likely mangling the names. I'm gonna do my best. There is a pronunciation guide at the back of the book. I have no excuse, so moving forward, I will try. Um, but anyways, for centuries, the legend of Robin Hood and his band of thieves has captivated the imagination. Now, the old familiar tale takes on new life, fresh meaning, and an unexpected setting. Hunted like an animal by Norman invaders, Bran at Bricken, heir to the throne Elphael, or Elphael, has abandoned his father's kingdom and fled to the Greenwood. There, in the primeval forest of the Welsh borders, danger surrounds him, for this woodland is a living, breathing entity with mysterious powers and secrets, and Bran must find a way to make it his own if he is to survive. Steeped in Celtic mythology and the political intrigue of medieval Britain, Stephen Lawhead's latest work conjures up an ancient past and holds a mirror to contemporary realities. Prepare yourself for an epic tale that dares to shatter everything you thought you knew about Robin Hood. About Stephen Lawhead, it says, Stephen R. Lawhead is an, an, in, eh, is an internationally acclaimed author of myth, mythic history and imaginative fiction. His works include the Song of Albion trilogy, Byzantium, Patrick, the Pendragon Cycle series, and the Dragon King trilogy. Lawhead makes his home in Oxford, England with his wife. Totally gonna check out all of his other stuff because that is super interesting. There is a uh, map here. A lot of the locations are look to be Welsh, so I absolutely... See, it looks like it says Simru, but I don't think that's how that's pronounced, so I'm going to have to look into a lot of that. Um, well, this is an excerpt from The Paradise War, book one in the Song of Albion trilogy. Oh, this was something else that I wanted to... Right. So there's a thing back here. It says, you've experienced the legend. Now hear the soundtrack. And there's actually an album of music inspired by the, the trilogy of books, Hood, Scarlet, and Tuck, which is super neat. Um... And then it's, the, here's the pronunciation guide. It says, many of the old Celtic words and names are strange to modernize, but they are not as difficult to pronounce as they might seem at first glance. A little effort and the following rough guide will help you enjoy the sound of these ancient words. Yep. <laughs> so there you go. I, I, that's not even a Welsh guide. I think it's just Celtic. Ah, I'm screwed. Okay, I'll have to look up some stuff because I don't want to be like Simru, you know? 
Um, it is 472 pages, so if we are starting January 25th, um, that's going to be roughly 17 pages a day to make it through from January 25th to February 25th. More or less, I'd go with 18 just to be on the safe side. Um, so that's challenging um, for all of us, myself included. Used to be I'd laugh at a challenge like this. When I was in high school, pfft, I used to get in trouble for reading too much. Now I'm rusty. So, you know, we'll all be struggling. Uh, yeah, so as I said earlier, um, or maybe you guys won't be, you know, I'm making some assumptions here. But, um, like I said, so the videos will be, uh, set up with chapters so that, again, you guys can avoid spoilers just in case and, um, jump ahead to a chapter if you wanted to see, you know, you wanted to talk about it. And it's an open discussion. Please, by all means, if you disagree with anything that I say or if I'm wrong and if you want to correct me on names um, by all means jump in I'd love to hear your guys's thoughts and uh, if you're not interested in reading the book but still interested in kind of just hanging around hanging you know hanging out and uh, listening in and you know taking part anyways um, that's also totally fine like you don't you don't have to it's not like homework right like I'm not gonna grade you guys if you don't finish it it happens like I said no grading. And you can keep reading long after the month. The idea of these videos is that they'll exist for a long time afterward, so you can always just keep coming back, even if I've started another book, if I go past February 25th. Um, the idea is basically just that this is a book club that can be started at any time, and obviously there is a record of this. And I, you know what? If you come late to this and you still want to talk about it in the comments, by all means, join in. You know, it's just for fun. And uh, yeah, so thank you so much, you guys. I'm so excited and I was so happy to see that there was so much interest in it. And I hope you guys are interested. Obviously, it had to be a Robin Hood book. Um, and I am genuinely really, really excited. I was gonna read, excuse me, I was gonna read the prologue to you guys, but um, I have some, some throat <laughs> congestion. So I'm gonna start getting real weird and nasally as I read it and kind of like coughing a little bit, so. Not, probably not going to happen. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you guys. And I hope you have uh, a good time. And I will see you every Tuesday for our book club meeting. I know it's usually... No, actually, yeah, this is how it's structured. Everybody meets every week and then they talk about what they read. So, yeah, there we go. All right, cool. Bye.